uh, your old team is looking very good um, on the field these days and on the points table. Do you think the Rajasthan Royals are uh, primed for a win this time? The Rajasthan Royals have had an amazing squad in the last couple of years, and I was very surprised that the Rajasthan Royals didn't win the IPL last season because of because of the incredible squad and well balanced team that, that 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 they had. And this year, for me, is no surprise at all. They're, they're just they've got no weaknesses. There's no holes at all. The only challenge the Rajasthan Royals that I see is just when the Rajasthan Royals lose Josh Butler, which is coming up over the next couple of weeks. He's got to go back to for an England series. So that will be the only time where things could sort of be shaken up a little bit with the Rajasthan Royals. But apart apart from that, they're just so well balanced. I've got an incredible team, an incredible squad to be able to pick from as well. So most teams have got one, probably one hole that they're trying to find their way around, whereas the Rajasthan Royals have not had one at all. And for me, there's no secret to the reason why they've had so, so much success, and especially this year. Does it feel like it did in 2008 when you were part of the squad? Well, it does the way they're coming together and, and the way the way they're performing. In 2008, um, within a game or two, we realised that we didn't have any holes. Everyone was at their very best. There wasn't any weaknesses really in our team at all, the way the team had come together. And, and the Rajasthan Royals this season, there certainly does not seem like any weaknesses at all. And for their ability to be able to continue to back up game after game um, has been something very impressive. So there certainly is quite a lot of similarities between you know the way the team continues to to grow like they are and being so incredibly well led by Sanju Sampson as well. He's just really coming of age as a leader and obviously as a cricketer as well with the incredible performance he's had with the bat, which you know, no, no surprises why he got picked in the in the T20 World Cup squad for India.